Hello and welcome to the Farming Simulator 17 my friends uh, I will show you uh, the first few things in the me menu uh, as you can see we can uh, have a career, multiplayer, tutorials, mod those are my uh, installed mods so that I already uh, installed uh, achievements I don't have any of those yet uh, and options you have quite a lot of options uh, if you compare this uh, to the previous version Farming Simulator 15 game uh, and then you have uh, a lot of uh, controls options those are all of the controls you, you can uh, adjust and uh, controls too for your controller as you can see I am playing this game with a G27 racing wheel um, and those are my settings I'm not sure if those are correct for now I'm still uh, finding the best uh, options for the steering wheel so as you can go to the career you choose the save game you choose the difficulty uh, it's basically the same and then you choose the map this is the same as well uh, oh you have uh, two maps at the beginning uh, this is Snowka which I believe is the same as it was in gold edition of farming simulator 15 and this uh, gold crest valley uh, I believe this is American map and I am playing in this map for the beginning now let's choose Snowka and this is new now you can have a female character or male character and you can also uh, change color of the shirt you, uh, the character is wearing so I will just be a man continue and then you can select uh, the mods you want to to be in your game so I will just select all for now and the game is being loaded there are quite a lot of details uh, in game that weren't uh, in the 15 game before before the mods came out at least as you can hear the engine of the combine is running more in the higher apps when I when I'm not uh, harvesting anything but if I go to harvest something the refs will load because the engine is suffering and this is new American map I quite like it uh, it's, uh, it's a little bit bigger than Snoke I think and it's just different because we saw the Snoke in Farming Simulator 15 so it's not that interesting anymore as you can see no big deal here at loading uh, trailer basically the same, the straw on the floor is basically the same it's just a different texture what, it, what is new is that you can tip basically anywhere you want uh, I can also tip here if I want just hold the left control button and press I I can tip here on the floor if I want and you can also choose the, the tip side you would like to, to tip from from your trailer so if you press uh, U button I can also tip from the grain door at the back of the trailer watch this watch this left control and I like the most are the tractors the new tractors that you get with the game for example this Walter this is just one of my favorites really no big deal in the blows or cultivators though they are just a little bit better than they were in the Farming Simulator 15 version 
so no big deal when you're plowing as well just I think the, even the texture is pretty much as it was what I don't like is that you don't get this game with the plow mode already so if you think a little bit you can remember probably from the farming simulator 15 there was a mod called uh, plow mode or plowing, plowing mode so what it was uh, if you had one wheel on the non plowed field and one wheel in the plowed field the wheel in the wheels on the plowed field uh, they went to the ground a little bit so it was like you were blowing in real life where here you you just drive over it so it's a shame but it's just a matter of time when the when will the mod come out so you just have to wait a little bit so here we have the Fint 939 Vario and Lely Ox, I'm not collecting anything. Uh, Lely Loading Wagon, they're really nice, nicely made about things. And nope, my steering is still not set right. What's new? You can also drive the train. I think you can load it with the logs and grain and drive it to the store or something, I'm not sure. 